Greetings, Twin Flame Lover. Hi, it's Dr. Amanda Noel, the Twin Flame Matchmaker. Are you an Atlantean Twin Flame, Lightworker, or High Priestess? To find out, stay tuned. So first of all, what is Atlantis? We've all heard about Plato's myth. We heard about a huge volcano that erupted and created a flood, and indeed, I believe that that was recently proven. If you look online, you can look at a documentary that was done on PBS where a couple of scientists went over to Greece, to Crete, and they found lots of seashells up in the mountains of Crete. The reason this is so significant is they carbon tested the seashells and found out that this happened at the exact same time that the volcano Thera had gone off in Santorini, Greece. So there was a cataclysm that went from the volcano there, went through the ocean, created a huge earthquake and tsunami, and that wiped out many, many peoples and pretty much the Atlantean civilization that was in Northern Crete. Why this is so important is because Atlantis is more of a symbol. Atlantis was a time or more of a grid where there is no time and no space where we are meant to align the royal abundance, also technologies, temples, wealth, money systems, with the feminine pleasure, masculine systems with the feminine pleasure, pleasure of the lower chakras, mother nature, our natural resources, aligning at the heart fully so that we can have technologies that align with sustainability so we can stop driving polluting cars, so that we can have temples that don't teach us to shame our sexuality, but we have temples that express all of who we are. So if you are an Atlantean high priestess, you will have ancient memories come through, you will have dreams. I started seeing these massive temples that looked like Italy or Greece or something and I didn't understand. I was often in bathing temples or something like a temple with water pools and I was given tours by angels. I was like, what is this? This happened in my 20s and it was very confusing because I had no textbooks to explain why it was happening. So you'll have Gnostic experiences like that, paths of knowledge, memory waking up. You'll also have natural healing gifts, abilities cultivated during those lifetimes, the ability to channel, to know, the ability to transmute energy, to heal, heal through your hand chakras, to heal through your words, sound, light, vibration. You'll be attracted to certain healing modalities. Maybe it's sound healing. Maybe it's working with crystals. Maybe it's working with plant medicines. Maybe it is working with the energy of Tantra and sex magic. Survivors of the flood of Atlantis went to the area in Egypt around the Great Pyramid of Giza. This became the capital city for the survivors. And we are still calling back the ancient texts, the magic, the technology, the systems of Atlantis. We also learned from the fall of Atlantis that too much structure, too much masculine technology can fry the feminine. And I know if you're an Atlantean high priestess, you probably love your iPhone, your technology, and you also find systems sometimes very oppressive and you wanna just escape it and go off grid. So it's that balance of the modern with the magic. That's why we Atlantean high priestesses at this time around post 2012, we are ready for this golden era to call in a masculine counterpart who can support us to bring back these rich sex magic practices so that we can manifest with orgasm, so we can create sustainable energy fields and we can have our scientists support sustainable energy technologies. This happens by healing the past, healing our past lives, and it starts in the now. That's the only place we can access the past is in the now. Tantric practices, healing, meditation, all of this has to be part of your high priestess or high healed priestess as I call it, regimen. As an Atlantean high priestess, you're not only here to be wealthy and abundant. Yes, that's part of our nature. We like the royalty, the royal purple energy from the cosmos, the riches, the abundance. We like money. And we can't have any of that if we don't align it with the natural fields of Mama Gaia. We have to respect our children, the indigenous people, the indigenous medicine within ourselves that's still awakened. We have to make sure that we're in balance 
and we come from a place of service as we serve ourselves. That is the path of the Atlantean priestess of the twin flame, is to be of service as we serve ourselves, that yin and yang. There's so much to know about Atlantis. I myself have an ancient bloodline through my Egyptian and ancient Hebrew lineage. It's something that awoke in my 20s and continues to awaken through dreams, through Gnostic experiences, through plant medicine, meditation. I would love to answer your questions and to serve you as the priestess that I am. Subscribe, I will see you in the next video. Twin Flame Blessings.